Hello folks and welcome here again to Divine Fine Motors and thank you so, so very much for being here. God bless you and your family and I mean that with all of my heart. I hope and pray that you're happy, healthy, and wealthy and in excellent, excellent place in your life wherever you may be seeing this at this moment. And folks, I've got you another absolutely i think one of the finest half ton pickup trucks that were ever ever manufactured especially by toyota i've had four of these myself i never did get up to the big double cab xsp edition but here you go if you want one this is the one to get folks this is a florida owned truck this as i said is a 2006 double cab xsp edition it's got leather interior i only thing i had to do to it i had to put a new air conditioning compressor and system on it we had it professionally done i spent about six hundred dollars had it all uh, drained out vacuumed out new compressor it is ready to go and it is absolutely gorgeous as you can see and you know if i've got it it's a good one to have i believe it was bought brand new right there courtesy uh toyota here of brandon that's around the tampa bay area here in the great sunshine state of florida it's got the big chrome exhaust tip on it it's got the mud flaps it's got some of the best i think the prettiest wheels that ever come on these trucks the big 20 inch uh I call them icky wheels. It's got the fender flares, the running boards, and again, it is absolutely gorgeous. You have your power rear window that goes up and down. It's got the owner's manuals. It's got three keys. It's got a key fob. It's got the alarm. I mean, look at it. It's just absolutely gorgeous. These are getting harder and harder for me to find. And I know if they're getting harder for me to find, you're having a difficult time finding them too. But praise God, here we go. We have one here that you will absolutely love. Again, it only has about 130,000 miles. Florida owned, it's got the Toyota guard protection that came on it new. It did have a timing belt replaced at some point, although that's not a big thing to me at all, especially with these 4.7 liter motors. I call them the million mile motors and uh, they will do that. Uh, this one is just in excellent, excellent condition. You're probably wondering why I'm not in front of my house. Well, there's a good reason this is over here by my shop. And uh, because my wife is having her book club meeting there tonight, LOL. And my driveway is full of about eight or ten those nice book club ladies that convene every month that talk about their books. My wife's been doing that, I think, since like 2009. God love her. She is an avid reader, which we all like to read. But anyway, that's why I'm here doing it here. I found me some shade, and it's working out really, really nice for you. Underneath this truck is just like the rest of my vehicles. You know, I do everything I can to go out and find these nice Florida-owned vehicles. Spare tires never even been on the ground on this thing. It's got the nice towing package, but folks, it is awesome. You got some good meat left on your big 20 inch uh, tires there. Uh, these things are really an amazing truck. You know, they have a factory transmission cooler built into them. Uh, this one's got the locking tailgate, which you might be aware of. It also has your mats. They're a little dirty, but not bad for 2006. It's got a super nice sprayed in bed liner few little spots of wax here and there but that'll come up but looks like he never even used it you can see how nice everything is here in the back all of your stuff here is in excellent 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 condition you'll love these trucks it will last you my buddy's got one with almost 450,000 miles on it and uh he hadn't even put a water pump in his yet but anyway they're the best half-ton pickup trucks out there. You're not going to find one better. 
there's just no way. And Toyota, shame on you for building that ugly new Tundra that's out. I can't believe it. It's got the nice leather seats, the XSP headrest, the armrest, the wood grain. You got CD. You have, it's never had a cigarette smoked in it. Cigarette lighter's never been used. Like I said, you got all the books, all your keys, key fob. It's got the alarm on it. You got a nice, uh, your lug nut lock there. It's got all your stuff here. Everything that came with this truck brand new, you still got all that good stuff. I'll make sure that stays in the uh, glove compartment for you. I think I've even got an invoice in there for them putting in the air conditioning system for me. So you're good to go, folks. Time and belt, air conditioning, new compressor. You can see the carpets are immaculate. All the door jams. I mean, this is going to be just a nice, nice truck. You'll love it as everybody does that's ever had one. You can see it is just in pristine condition. I just love them. You just the looks of them. You, you, I'm telling you, if you've never owned one before, once you have it, you won't want another truck. <laughs> They're just great. They set up nice and high, even the two-wheel drives. Uh, these, I think, might even have a locking differential in the back. You could Google the VIN or ask some people on that, but I'm pretty sure they do. The underneath of these seats and everything are just absolutely immaculate, as you'll see. Let me try to put that up for you. There you go. You got the jack and everything uh, in there. That's good. The headliner, power rear window, it works. That's nice. Got your armrest back here. Boy, that's tight. It's probably never, ever been out. I'm probably the only one that's ever opened that up. Cup holders, I don't think anybody's ever truly set in the back seats of this beautiful, beautiful truck. That's one of the reasons my buddy wanted a Tundra because he could lay down back here. He's not that tall. And he told the salesman when he went to get his truck, he had told me a story. He said, uh, why do I need to get in that back seat there and see how it, uh, see if I can lay down. That's kind of the way he talks. And uh, he said, I need to be able to sleep back there. Of course, he's a truck driver most all of his life, God love him. And uh, so he fit, he bought the truck. He still had it. I think his is a Maybe a 2002, 2001, drives it all the time. But uh, this is something special here, folks. This will not last till the end of the auction. Let me say that again, because a lot of you will call, not a lot of you, but some of you will call and be a little upset because I ended it early on eBay. And I tell everybody, I give everybody that opportunity to go ahead and buy it now before the reserve has been met, and I'm very, very fair. You know, I have to pay for these. I, they don't give them to me. And the ones that I want, guess what? Everybody wants them. Well, the blessing that I have is, number one, I'm blessed because I'm a devout Christian and love the Lord with all my heart, soul, and my mind, and I have favor. But I don't have a bunch of salespeople. It's just me and my lovely bride and... Um, uh, my detail guy when he shows up on occasion. I really don't need him that bad anyway because all of my cars are clean when I buy them. They're mostly clean. I do like to spriff them up a little bit because I'm such a absolute perfectionist. But uh, you're gonna love this thing. It runs, dries, and rides 1,000%. Like I say, the ashtray's never been used cigarette lighters never been used hallelujah stereo works great you got your little goofy tire pressure light on there that's just one of those batteries in them tpm sensors you can get those now about four of them for less than 30 40 bucks and uh tire kingdom will put them in there for you or tire plus or whoever you got got a uh, sunglass holder there you got your map lights like I say, you got the back window. It works. Make sure you use that every now and then to keep that working. A lot of times, uh, people don't use them and that thing will 
not work after a while. But anyway, only 130,780 little Florida pampered miles. And folks, down here, it's not only that we don't have rust and salt and all that, the roads are like highways down here. I'm from West Virginia. I know what it's like up there. Look how nice everything is. But uh, the uh, you don't have potholes. You don't have big curves. You don't have mountains. You don't have any of that stuff. Oh, yeah, look underneath here. How nice it is in the front. Look at that. Man, you're getting you something special here. I hope you take good care of it. But... You're looking at the best power plant they ever built, in my opinion, from Toyota so far. These things are true, tried, and absolutely amazing. Uh, this truck will last you, like I said, as long as you want to use it. Looks like maybe somebody might have put some new uh, spark plugs and did a tune-up. Maybe put some new uh, coils in it. it. says there that it's had a new timing belt at some point. Usually that... They want you to do that at 100,000 miles. I'll tell people, don't worry about it at all. It's not going to break. Now, if you have your water pump go out or something like that, yeah, you might want to change that time of built, but it's not a real big deal on these motors, folks. It truly isn't. But anyway, you do whatever you want to do. The oil, it's as clean as a pen. And let me tell you something. When you use it and it's got 300,000 miles on it, that oil will look like that up until about five, six, seven thousand 7,000 miles because these motors are so well sealed. They run so smooth. They're just, they can't, you can't beat them. All right, now listen, I've gone on enough about this truck, so you need to call one of those numbers on that ad. I'll be happy to tell you what the reserve is and you can buy it at that now. If I let this truck run without even till the end who knows where it would go like i said there's not many out there and folks this is a nice one so uh, give us a holler and i want to shout out real quick to all of you all who have bought from carol and, I and the kids we appreciate each and every one of you you know it's about over 2700 now we're going on our 14 years in april Praise God, isn't that great? I left a BMW dealership about 14 years ago. They just complained all the time that I wasn't making them enough profit, wasn't making them enough profit. I got tired of listening to it. So me and my wife got our own dealer's license, and praise God, here we are. And, yeah, I make a little profit, but I go on to the next one and make a little bit off of that one. If I sell my 10, 12 cars a month, 14 then we pay our bills and life goes on. So congratulations. We love you. God bless you. And if you're new to Divine Fine Motors, welcome to the family. And listen, get this truck. It is awesome. Got to go. We love you. God bless you. Remember, be kind to one another. Love on one another. Lift each other up. And please, Lord, please read to those kids. Tell them how great they are. Tell them how wonderful and all the wonderful things they're going to go out and do in the world. Give them a lot of hope and a lot of self-confidence to go out and do great, wonderful things. we got to go. Bye-bye. Congratulations on finding this one.